Today is November 26th, 2023. We're getting ready to leave the hotel and head to the Port of Miami. Honestly, there's something so freeing about being on the water, surrounded by nothing but fresh air, waves, stars, and the moonlight. I miss this. I miss this more than you could imagine. Some folks go on cruises to get drunk and party, and there's nothing wrong with that. I go on cruises for this moment right here, my little star globe as I call it. walk into the bus for this tour this is my third time being in the bahamas and so originally my mom and i planned not to do an excursion but we decided kind of last minute like let's just do one so we did the essential bahamas sites and flavors tour it was really fun i enjoyed it i met a lot of cool people explored ate good food as you will see Y'all, let me get a man like this one. He is shooting content. I love it. Ooh! I love it. This is the distillery and they give you free tasting of the rum. Much busier now at this time. It's around noon. I think it actually is literally noon. Noon 30. Thank you, sir. <laughs> we are currently on day two of the cruise, just got back in from the Bahamas. I went on a tour with my mom and some awesome people from the ship that also booked this excursion. So that was really cool. I even met some people from Nevada, or really literally from Las Vegas, where I live right now. So that was dope. I'm currently going to 
take a nap because I was already kind of tired this morning so that I could stay up later today and, you know, enjoy the cruise and have fun and eat even more. Um, this is my view right now. This is my view right now. So beautiful. So beautiful. Yeah, so definitely super excited to share so much more. I had a whole plan for this video, so hopefully I stick to that plan. And if not, I know the video will still be amazing because, I mean, how can you mess a blue water? Like, blue turquoise perfect water. You, you just, you can't, right? So, hopefully I don't. It's day three. We're headed out to Coco Cay, Bahamas with Royal Caribbean. We have this uh, glass bottom excursion we're gonna do, so I'm really excited. Freedom will sell away after us. We ended the night with dinner. I ordered escargot again, of course. After that, we took a stroll through Central Park on the way to watch Finest and his show. 
And after that, Love and Marriage was on immediately afterwards. And if you have not seen Love and Marriage on Royal Caribbean, make sure you watch that. It's hilarious. Cruise days are pretty chill. We went to the main dining room for brunch as we did most mornings. And I did not eat that coleslaw. Good morning, everybody. How are we doing today? We went to a top tier event for all platinum members and above with Royal Caribbean's Crown and Anchor. We explored some of the different areas we hadn't seen yet. We did go zip lining, but we weren't allowed to have cameras on us, even if you had like a mount or something like that. So I do not have footage. And then I totally forgot to buy my zip line photo. That was the only photo I wanted. We went to One Sky. It was a midday show. It was really good. Definitely when you're on Royal Caribbean, go see their shows. Their shows are always really, really good. Then we went to Johnny Rockets and we had shakes, burgers, BLTs, fries, onion rings, apple pie a la mode. my sunglasses because I'm trying to get this tan fixed here and on my chest but it's hot but nice day beautiful day Not even that hot it's like because the sun is beating on you so it makes you feel hotter but i would say maybe 80 degrees with some humidity and a nice breeze very pretty out here the island is definitely different than when we first came or the first two times i've been here very nice very nice very beautiful very peaceful i'm gonna head over to the beach and see if i can get in there There's a lot of people I went in the water already, but I forgot to bring my camera with me to bring y'all along. So let me show you. That's it. Swimming and recording is not exciting, so I'm out. The Dragon Cafe. Rice and 
it out to the barbecue spot on the ship. And then going up the elevator. So we're going now, deck 15. In the little solarium whirlpool. I don't think this one's adults only though, because this one's outside of the solarium. But the other one is closed, so we're in here. We've never been in this one, we went in the other one. <laughs> I'm about to read my book. See it over there. I guess people hide ducks on the cruise, and we ran into someone in the two gentlemen in the uh, elevator and they said uh, they have some duckies to give us because they hide people hide ducks I guess like a scavenger hunt on cruises Hiking Duns was super fun for me because one, I like hiking, two, I love water, so it's a win-win for me. I've been trying to get here for over a decade. I actually went on a cruise years ago going to Jamaica, which was rerouted due to a storm. And then again in 2020, I had planned to come to Jamaica and stay for about a week, but then we all know what happened in 2020. Finally making it here was just super fulfilling like it just made me super happy and I can't wait to go back to Jamaica to explore it personally I do not feel this hike is strenuous I feel like it is not easy but I feel like the average person can complete it I saw people completing it in jean shorts because they were not prepared no one told them what to expect for this excursion I saw people who were twice my age hiking it and I feel like everyone agreed that they were able to get it done without exerting themselves too far so if that's a thought that's holding you back from going to Dunn's, definitely delete, discard, throw away that thought because you can do it. You may be sore if you do not move your body normally, but again, it can be completed and it won't be as difficult as some people made it seem. <laughs> They only like fruit, so only people who wear the yellow helmet should be concerned. <laughs> if you're not wearing that color, you're okay. All right? If you look where the light is pointing, you will see them hanging, all those dark holes, they live inside them. While you're looking up, you have to do so with your mouth closed, all right? They're not party trees, all right? So they're all over, so while you walk through, you'll be seeing them flying around. We're going down the stairs. So this is how the case looks naturally. 
Right. And if you keep your eyes on the water, you see a perfect reflection. Thank you. 